All right, good morning, class. Welcome to the new year. Before we start today, does anyone have anything neat they did over summer vacation? Would anyone like to talk about their summer break? Yeah, Steven. My brother let me try marijuana. That's great, Steven. It was so awesome, you guys. I'm going to do it every day for the rest of my life. Okay, Steven, go to the principal's office. What? What? Go to the office. Did anyone have anything legal that they did over summer vacation? Yes, Billy. This summer, I teached a whale to jump out of its tail. What? This summer, over summer break, I teached a whale to jump out of his tail. What are you talking about, Billy? This summer, I teached a whale to jump out of his tail. Stop being silly. You're not making any sense. I'm not being silly. I'm answering your question. That's what I did this summer. I teached a whale to jump out of the water and then jump again so hard that his tail came off. Billy, that's impossible. Stop lying or I will send you to the principal's office. I'm not lying. Stop calling me a liar. This summer, I teached a whale to jump out of his tail on vacation. Billy, stop lying. You're wasting class time. I'm not lying, and you're calling me a liar is damaging my self-esteem as a student. Fine, then prove it. Prove what? Prove that you taught a whale to jump out of its tail. Uh, okay. How am I going to prove that here in Ohio? It's not like there's a ton of whales in Akron. Guess you can't prove me a liar, huh? <laughs> then where did you teach these whales to jump out of their tails? Florida. Son of a bitch, Billy. Totally did it. All right, class, get your shit. We're going to Florida. What about permission slips? Fuck permission slips! Here we go, Billy. I'm gonna prove you to be the lying liar that I know that you are. You will rue the day! Whatever, Miss Lambert. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. No seatbelt for Billy. Hey, no, I want my seat. No, no seatbelt for you. Maybe now, if we get in an accident, you'll think about showing your elders some respect. Sealand, 10 miles, here we go! Hello there, and welcome to Sealand Orlando, home to sea creatures of the world and beyond. Hi, yes, how are you doing? My name is Mrs. Lambert, and I teach third grade at Akron Elementary. Well, hello, Mrs. Lambert. My name is Timmy Williams, and I am the official sea greeter here at Sealand Orlando, home to sea creatures of the world and beyond. That's wonderful, thank you. Uh, I have a student here named Billy who claims he can teach a whale to jump out of its own tail. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Oh. That's impossible. Thank you. You would have to be like the greatest whale trainer ever born to do something like that. It is as you say. Oh my god. No, it's not. He's lying. He is a liar. Billy, be silent. Might we borrow one of your whales so that Billy could show us all this impressive feat of his? I am sorry, but we are temporarily out of whales here at Sealand Orlando, home to sea creatures of the world and beyond. You see, the last hurricane that came through here, Jennifer, picked up all the whales up out of their tank and dropped them down onto the old abandoned barbed wire factory on the outskirts of town. We found old Sham Sham with his tail all twisted up and impaled on a piece of barbed wire. He's trying to get back to the sea with his little whale fins. He made it about halfway through the basketball court, but he just couldn't get his tail free, so he slowly baked to death there on the asphalt while the local school kids came out and used his body as a bike ramp. I could have taught him how to get away from his tail. Billy, shut up! Everybody back in the car, we're going to Mexico! Let's go, kids! I'm coming with! You know a whale's heart is eight times the size of a man's? I heard that Sham Sham finally died when some kid stabbed him in the eye with a ruler. But I think his heart was just too big for this world. I want all of the children to make a promise to me that when Billy is discovered to be a liar, they will not be friends with him anymore. Hey, Miss Lambert, how do you get all those cool blue lines in your legs? <laughs> <laughs> Mexico, four miles! Bienvenidos de la Oceana del México, la Casa de la Oceanas Morinos. Hola, me llamo is Mrs. Lambert, and I teach third grade at Akron Elementary in Akron, Ohio. Uh, I have a student here named Billy who claims he can teach a whale to jump out of its tail. Dios mío! Only the one foretold in prophecy who could one day unite the eight wandering tribes of Mexico can accomplish such a feat. Behold, I am among you. Oh. No, he's lying. He is a liar. Billy, I will beat you lifeless. Might we borrow one of your whales so that Billy could show us all this impressive feat? <laughs> Silly lady, there are no whales in Mexico. Then why does your sign say whale world? What that sign right there that says Wahali world. What the fuck is a Wahale? That's kind of like a Jalupa. There's whale in it. Okay, that's it. I'm gonna find one myself. Kids to the ocean, let's go. I'm coming with. 
The ocean, she's crazy. Once saw a dolphin jump out of the water 20 feet, and on its way down, clubbed a girl in the head with a lead pipe. Okay, just stop the boat here. This is a good spot. Billy, I am gonna find you a whale. And I'm gonna teach it to jump out of its tail. And unite the brethren of the wandering tribes. Maybe. Ah, shucks, kid. I just wish you the best. Whale ho! Right off the starport side. Okay, everybody, let's pay attention as Billy teaches this whale to jump out of its own tail. Billy, the floor is yours. <laughs> 